up in these two zones. So the market has actually been stuck in these two levels. And today's the second day the market hasn't really broken out of this zone. Now, you really need to now open your eyes and see uh ranges yeah that's 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 what i'm looking for oh shoot shoot man shoot man that's what i'm not that's not what i'm trying to do that's not what i'm trying to do china so let's see what we can do let's see what we can do so yeah so the market is stuck in the range right now and you can see that the market is sort of forming a double top pattern which is really uh, telling us that the market is failing to either break um, above or even below look at how we spiked below that level look at how we spiked above that level the market has been really moving around that level now going on to an even smaller time frame you're able to see possibilities for this market to basically just sink and dip from whatever level we're in right now however you don't want to assume that the market will break as yet this is one thing that traders do and this is one thing that really messes people's uh trading up that people really try to uh people really try to assume that the market will kind of break out of this zone and the market hasn't really told you that it's going to break out or not so you don't have to assume that the market will break out of this zone what you have to do right now is you have to wait for the market to give you indication nas 100 zix just sent a request let's take him as 100 before we move on let's take nas 100 perfect president is in the building <laughs> <I have. laughs> okay guys <laughs> nas 100 zix now back to what we were doing um here's what's up here's what's up here is what's up here's what's up here's what's up so now you don't really have to conclude that this thing will either break up or, or below you just have to wait for it to tell you whether it's going to go up or not so you really have to wait for the market to determine whether it's going to go up or down at this point the market hasn't really told us anything we are still stuck up in this range i would rather suggest that you wait for the market to break out of this range before you can actually start taking any kind of um, trades right now but for now you can clearly see that the market is still trapped within these zones and you really want to basically um you really want to basically um kind of understand this formation so the market can come tap into the slow break above for that pullback onto that higher level or even break below this region so you really need to sort of um, be open-minded to that one of the biggest mistakes that traders do is that traders are gonna are gonna assume that this thing is about to break and then this thing comes to support and then goes back up so you really need to listen to the market let the market tell you what it's gonna do you don't really want to assume that the market will do this and this and that allow the markets to tell you and to guide you on where the next possible move is going to be but for now we do know that this is a bearish market and we do know that the structure is actually extremely bearish you just want to basically wait for that move to happen before you can actually come into that particular market now going on to nas 100 that's what we're going to look at right now nasdaq let's look at nasdaq okay before that before we go to nas before we go to nas let's let's maybe speak about gold a little and let's see where gold can potentially head to so if we break past that 1800 1750 is a level of anticipation uh that's where we wanna actually um that's where we wanna we wanna go to 1750 past 1750 we're going to 1700 on gold and these are my targets on gold see ya my boy you know i got you dog i got you my boy i got you you know dog you know what it is now looking at nas 100 nas 100 let's look at let's look at the formation of nas so if you look at this right if you look at this formation on NAS, so this is what I went through with uh, with my students today on the class. I was doing a one-on-one. -on -one, I was actually showing them this and tr really trying to show them that, um, you know, this is what's happening and this is what can potentially happen on this market. However, you're obviously, um, you know, um, open to the fact that the market can actually give you anything at that point and you really have to take whatever move the market is giving you at that particular moment so now the market has actually been trending up so the market has been 
extremely bullish as you can see the this market is a bullish market the market is a bullish market and the market hasn't changed its structure ever since we've just been bullish we've just been bullish now the market is also like kind of like stuck in this in this region so look at how then look at how then this market is forming right now the market came from this area and went up to that level came to this area went up to this level now this is a level that has been a problem on nasm 100 because then the market has been failing to break past this level so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put a little a little marker thing a little marker and a little um what can i say like i want to put like i want to put something that can remind me as i'm trading that this is actually a strong psychological level so the market the market is the market is, is being thrown into that level and as the market has been thrown into that level something really tries to happen around that region now look at how the market was thrown into this level market then dipped back into the lows look at how it's thrown into this level market then it dips into the lows but look at how it's thrown again into this level however this time around the market is thrown into that level and there's a specific formation that's happening as the market has been thrown to that level you've got this area over there you've got that area over there You've got that area over there and you've got that area over there now look at how look at how the the market is now forming a series of highs even when we know that this is a strong zone but the market is now squeezing to the upside meaning that the market is being pushed into the highs so the market has actually been squeezed into the highs even when the market is failing to break past this region however the market is actually right now pushing itself into the highs now this is the only level we're actually looking at right now to basically try and understand what can potentially happen around there what can potentially happen now this is on the daily time frame again now we don't want to trade we want to trade 15 minute time frames we want to trade five minutes or m1s those are time frames that we use to basically get the pinpoint entries that we're actually looking for and to basically understand the details that are actually happening on the charts for us to capitalize and maximize on our profits around that level and region this is on the daily now on the daily what we're looking for is we're just typically looking for areas in which we can actually mark out and spot and identify look at this one we've got an uninvited guest uninvited guest out out yeah so we're looking for areas in which we can basically kind of capitalize on from the high time frame knowing that this level is a strong level or this level is a weak level whatever level that is we're actually trying to see how we can trade the market from that level so we're really now observing that high because we know that this high is actually a really strong high that has been holding for i mean look at this like look at look at the dates from here like look at the dates from here this was this was now the 13th of October, 2020. 2020, what's the date today? Let's see on the other screen. What's the date today, buddy? Let's see. Uh, how do I even check my date there? Open time and date preference. Uh, okay, let's wait for it to pop up. Let's see the date today. Whatever, I know people, some people got paid like yesterday or something. So I do know that it's like 25th or something like that. That's 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 the date. So it's around about the 25th. So that's that's the date. That's the date. So that's the date. So date and time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Today is like the 26th. Yeah, 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 yeah. So right now, uh, so from the 13th of October, when was this? Let's see. From the 13th of October. And today is now the 26th of November and the markets have actually been failing to break past that levels. So this level has actually held for over a month, meaning that this is a strong level. If the market is pushed out of this zone, the push will really be stronger. The push will be a strong push, which is why then we're going to say that watch what's, what, watch what's going to happen on NASDAQ because then we do know that that level and area is a very strong area and level that we want to actually focus on and put our eyes on so we're able to catch and maximize on that move that's going to happen upon the break of that region. Now, dropping down to a smaller time frame now, we're trying to get the finer details. Remember that uh, I need to show my face when I talk about this. Remember that when you look at the daily time frame, when you look at the daily, you're already thinking about the weekly and the monthly. 
when you look at the four hourly, you're already thinking about the daily. Look at the hourly, you're already thinking about the four hourly and the daily. Look at 30 minutes, you're already looking at the hourly, the four hourly, and the and the daily. Looking at the M15, you're already thinking about the higher time frame. You're not just trading that time frame. You're trading bigger time frames, even when you're dropping down to smaller time frames. Even when you go to M1, you're going to M1 and you're already thinking about how the daily candle is going to close, how the four hour candle is going to close, how the H1 candle is going to close, how the M, M, M30 candle is going to close, how the um, you know M15, how the M5 is going to close. You're not just trading that specific time frame, which is something that people don't really understand, don't really get that much. That you're not just trading time frames, you're trading the whole structure, you're trading the bigger picture. So that's what you really understand. Like that's what you really need to understand. That you're not just trading that that level, you're trading the bigger structure. You're not trading that time frame. So you really need to think big and move out of that smaller time frame shell that most people actually have in their minds. So let's go back to our charts and let's see what we have here. So we do have that zone now coming down to the to the four hourly. Now the the H four time frame can can already tell us that the daily the daily the daily candle has already failed on breaking the zone. How do we see that? How do we see that? You know, how do we see that? We see that on how then the past previous candles. I mean, this was actually quite an easy move. Like if you look at this, I'm sure I just shed light on someone. I'm sure I just really taught someone a thing or two. I'm sure I really did. I'm sure I really did. Like I really did teach someone something there. I know. Now let me let me explain. Let me explain what's really happening over here, so you guys are able to basically understand what is really happening around this level. So now, this is what we have. We've got market thrown into that level so now this is this is look at look at how look at how stretch is forming right so we've got bullish pressure market pulls back bullish pressure pressure runs out and market is now indecisive at this point this is what we call indecision this is what we call indecision 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 candlesticks when the market is going to fail to break above once fail to break above twice fail to break above three times this is four eight 12 hours the market has been stuck around that level for 12 hours now after 12 hours we get one candlestick that engulfs the past previous 12 hours in just four hours the market engulfs the past previous 12 hours in just four hours think about that like that alone guys that alone is so big in just four hours the market engulfs the past previous 12 hours worth of work the market tried for 12 hours to break past that level or the market was just stagnant for 12 hours. But in just four hours, the past 12 hours has been wiped out, meaning that the move that happens in that four hour candle is much more bigger than the move that happened in the past previous 12 hours, meaning that now the market is giving us indications of where it can potentially go to next. Now, the market is now telling us where it's going, where it's headed to. See, I, see, I can see this, see, I can see this. He's now sending bears, he's sending bears because he can see that this market is now rejecting off of that high and the market is now putting in some bearish momentum. So now, the market is now confirming to us that we're literally going bearish, right? So we're literally going bearish, but again, we don't want to confirm as yet that this cell that's going to come is a big cell because there, there's still levels and areas to actually break. There's still levels and areas to actually start, uh, you know, start actually like, um, you know, overcoming and conquering. So what we want to do is we want to focus on the targets that we can set for now before we can actually come in with bigger and long-term targets for trend line traders trend line traders i don't know how y'all guys draw our trend lines but i mean um you can you can surely come out with something over here like i don't know how you do it but um i think if you if you look at this um so if i try to draw a channel over here i really haven't looked at this chart for the longest time so please do believe me if you look at this I mean, you do have some kind of a channel that's forming over there. I think this is how channels are, are typically formed. I wouldn't know. Now you do have a shoulder and a head and a shoulder over there. So now this market is actually looking to me more like a selling market more than anything. So this market is going to be, you know, selling 
to like the lows so we can see that this market has potentials to sell back into the lows so we can actually come back into this level and reach it before we actually head to the upside so let's see what the comments are saying 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 filter back filter back uh so someone is saying this is Cuban's trading style. Q and myself were mentored by the same guy. So, I mean, it's quite expected. It's quite expected, brother. We were mentored by the same guy, man. It's quite expected. It's quite expected, man. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see comments. Let's see comments. Let's see comments. Um, let's see comments. Oh, people saw that head and shoulder. Uh, okay. Uh, so cause it's such a strong zone I'm feeling a bit bearish it's really bearish please save this live video doc I'll try and save it Nez will drop every time frame is important yo my doctor please save the live I'll save it yo how long have you been online it's been a while man it's been a while I think I've been online for about 30 minutes or so I don't know I think 30 40 minutes or even an hour I don't know Benja means a hey Oga Doctor, do you execute based on break in market structure or candlestick formation? I look at everything. Candlestick formation, market structure. I look at my EMA. I look at uh, my zones. I look at um, the details in every single thing I have. So I, I look at quite a lot of things, to be quite honest. I look at a lot of things. I look at a lot of things. A lot. A lot of things. So, yeah. Uh, bearish head and shoulders. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I opening 100%, 100%. This is Nasdaq. Ulinyora when a vele vela, waiza, 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 waiza. That's how I don't even trade this thing, man. I'm just doing it for the people. I'm just analyzing for the people, to be quite honest. I'm just waiting on one confirmation. I'll just, I'll just send this to my signals group for people to just eat. You know what I'm saying? For people to just eat because I've confirmed that this thing is a sell, like I'm done. I just confirmed it on the live. I just confirmed it on this live. So I'll be sending entries and targets. And send your bears 100%, 100%. Well, I would do blind. Thank you. Do you execute by breaking market structure? The guy just answered that. Now it's going to drop. I saw shooting stars. The candlesticks are talking now. 100%. Now I'm seeing the lights and I'm learning. You're welcome, man. Please analyze gold. I just did. Uh, can you save the life? We'll do. I know I'm happy I joined with Genesis. You're welcome. You're welcome, Kel. Um, it was ranging on, on a 15-minute time, then finally broke out downside today. Um, come see your predictions, bro. Away. You're a top dog. Thanks, man. Yes, it's a drop. Yeah, I opening. I'm, ev I'm even in a profit. 100%. 100%. Uh, what Paris? That that's 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 Nasdaq. We have to look at the fundamentals as well. I mean, I don't really trade fundamentals. Fundamentals only are only spikes to me. I don't trade spikes, man. I trade the market structure. I trade market structure, my bro. Uh, who's that? Umchi. Umuche without filter. <laughs> Uh, which one is this one Nestec? who's your mentor bro well i took the astro course but most of the things that i do now are things that i do from experience and uh just short time just short time uh just short time which guy mentored you guys um so i i mentored my twin my twin mentor tokyo and everyone else in the group was just mentored by us collectively Bali Mox, Gino, Gift, Gino, Bobo, Zama. Every single one of us have actually had a thing to, uh, to, to contribute to our community. But my brother was personally mentored by myself. So, yeah. Uh, top much away, away. Mina Nyakfuma, my dog. Away Sia. Ah, even Sia was mentored by me. One of my best guys. You guys must 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 check. The candlestick speaks. The candlestick speaks. Uh British move from a ranging move today. 100 percent That really confirms something, man. It's gonna go down until what price? I didn't see clearly, bro. Um, look at eleven thousand five hundred. Eleven thousand five hundred. 
um, for one and eleven thousand two hundred. So eleven five, eleven two, that's somewhere around there. That's where I think that structure can actually be thrown into. Mm, I would there's a possibility of it forming a double top, then dropping, but before I anticipate a fake card, I don't think it's gonna form a double top, man. Please check DM away. Um Sean Lee Todd Q. 100 percent Yeah, man. Sean Todd Q. Thank you for the insight. It's 3 a.m. here in India. Bless up, dog. Hungry Lena. My man, bless you, bro. Bless you, man. I pray your eyes open as you sleep, man. Fruitful session. God bless. Simplicity is the way. 100%. The main man, Manando the Gold, my brother, my brother. Um, you to this, how much would you recommend is a good amount to start off with as a beginner? I wouldn't know, man, how much you afford. So we're selling for a month. Tomorrow it's Black Friday. Yeah, 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 man. Tomorrow's Black Friday. And we've got a special going on. My course is going for five thousand now for the one on one. From seven five to five thousand, the online from three point five to three thousand. Signals from one point five to one thousand. So do hit me up if you need any of my services. Uh, can you do US thirty? No, man. Uh, thanks for the knowledge. You're welcome. Can you please break down US thirty? No, no. Hey, bro. You got a signal channel. Yeah, man. The head and shoulders movement happened last night, but the institutional candles killed some accounts. I don't know what that is, man. Uh, what about US 30? No, man. Um, let me see. Uh, markets will get affected. I think the US 30 is still valid for a sell. I'll send it. Uh, the US 30 will be shared on the private on the private Telegram. Um, what software or platform? It's not a software. It's called Trading View. Uh, the one-on-one -on -one sessions this first DVM, yeah, I and mean, if you want to, if you want to book for December, you can basically do that. January, I'm taking my one-on-one -on -one to ten thousand. Around about March, it's going to fifteen thousand. By the middle of the year, it's going to be on twenty, because I'm not trying to have a lot of people that I train in person. That's why. And if you really want me to train you in person, then you really have to pay for that, because I mean. You know, the next year, next year we're, we're raising the bar, bro. Like, I'm not even going to lie. Hey, like, bro, like, we're raising the bar, like, high, bro. Like, it's really going to be mad. It's going to be crazy. It's going to be crazy. Next year is going to be a crazier. Like, I'm not even trying to lie to you right now. But, I mean, um, yo, it is what it is. <laughs> yo, 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 it is what it is. Yo, 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 it is what it is. Um, let's see, US 30, no man, what type of confirmation do you use a lot? Gold will go up to 850, lift felt to break, we're selling to, I did gold. Trust the charts again, bros, uh, pin entry, you can rewatch the live, I'll save it. Ness will drop, I was waiting to, I'll be going in when it drops, 100%. Gold I just did, please check your DMs, I will. If you send me a DM before this live, please send it again so I can go up, so I can really try to focus on it a lot quicker. Right, because I've got like countless DMs, man. It's just exhausting at times. Please do more YouTube videos. I will do, I promise. One day I'm willing to see you, my bro. You will, bro. Can you analyze US30? No, man. I I did US30 for my private telegram. How much is your face to face? Just to see my face is 7,500. The only way you can see my face is if you bump into me without me planning to see you. Ha <laughs> ha. Jokes, guys, jokes. <laughs> but I mean, uh, my one on one is 7,500, but it's now going for 5,000. So take the chance or miss it. I'm not going for, for the numbers. That's why I didn't drop it to 1,000 or drop it to 2,000 because I'm not really trying to get the numbers. I can easily do that and I'll get like 100 people coming to me. But I mean, I'm not really trying to get the numbers. I'm really trying to get. Minimal people that I can handle and polish their skill till they're really good traders. That's all I want to do. That's the legacy I'm trying to live behind. Uh, how do you spot perfect entries? That's that's not an easy thing. Uh, okay, I'll show you the charts just one more time, but you can always go back and rewatch. Um, Nasdaq could be a false break. A trade market structure to Astro Cost to Firm. I'm with Marcelino Villao, Small World. Oh, yeah, Marcelino's my boy, man. Marcelino's my boy. Tabi, so I see you, man. I need a mentor from your group, G. Uh, you can always send a DM. You took the Astro Cost. Damn, shout out King Sean Lee and Nat. Yeah, man. 
Astro Chun Li. Yeah, 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 bro. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. How often do you trade? I don't really trade that often because I obviously trade with targets. Um, so if I do really reach my target like earlier in the week, I'm not gonna trade. But this week, I took a bit of. I, I took. I took a loss. Not even a bit of a loss. I blew up on fifty two thousand rands. And it's quite stressful, but I mean, it, it is what it is. It's just one of those. It's one of those, and we keep moving. Uh, thanks for this live. Thank you so much, man. I'm proud to call you my mentor, bro. Zama, you know, came all the way from Cape Town to learn the skill, and he's very cooked. No lies. How do you find great entries? That's, yo, know, man, that's complicated. Someone update me about gold analysis. The live will be saved. You can rewatch it at Cubebanks, bro. Please come join. You can you can tell him to come join, bro. Tell him to come join. How can one be mentored by you, Doc DM? I am a sealer. I wear my brother. How do I join your signal? Send a DM, please. Volatility. I don't trade that. How long have you been trading the markets? Uh, three years now. Nice work, man. Thank you. You are too much. Thank you. Save the life. The life will be saved. Uh, you and stylish blood brothers were twins. Were twins. Uh, USD care, I don't know where that's going. I haven't looked at it. Why it's hard by US states, you know, man. US states are getting hard. Let me just show you. I just did US 30 now. Like, I just recorded US 30, man. I just recorded it. I'm not scared of it. The US states is the only thing I trade, by the way. These things that I analyzed, I don't trade them. I just did them for free because I know that there's followers who actually trade NASDAQ and gold. So I did it to give the other guys some insight in what I'm looking at. So, I'm not scared of US states, man. That's the only thing I trade. Literally, the only thing. If you go to my history, you will just find US states. There's not even an inch of Nasdaq. For the past eight months, I've been trading US states here alone. Um, any sentiments I did? Um, let me see. Let me see. Um, Cape Town sent a DM. Is December a good month to trade, Doctor? December is actually very slow, but still tradable. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Mm. Online cost 3,500 discounts to 3,000 on Black Friday. That's valid till the last day of the month. Mm. What's the dual of the one-on-one? -on -one? I mean, one-on-one, -on -one, you get everything. You get everything. You get to even ask them questions. I'm there with you. You're not doing it alone. But I mean, the online is still as good. I would recommend the online to anyone. Mm. So yeah, yeah, I just answered that. Please do US data. I want to see something. No, man, US data, I'm not going to do. Uh, doctor, thanks for being honest and sharing your loss. Thank you, man. Sent it DM away. You're changing lives, man. Tito Boyan is crazy. <laughs> He's mad, that guy. He's mad. What's your moving averages that share on the cost? Please, let's discuss entries. Uh, your skill is flames. You left. you left currencies. Yeah, man, I haven't been trading currencies for months now, man. For months. Going for a year now. I would do blind the street. Thanks, Peño. I thought you had two accounts. Stylish is a twin. Yeah, man. Great work. Me and my best friend are saving up for your one-on-one. -on -one. We're from Eastern Cape. Bro, may the Lord help you save that money for you to come and get the skill. Entries, um, Entries, man. Ish. I wouldn't know how to do entries on a live. I wouldn't know, honestly. I wouldn't know. That that needs like proper preps for me to actually deal with that. Uh, but obviously, uh, I mean, what is your YouTube page? Go search at Genesis Wealth Club. 3,000 rands, yes. 3,000 South African rands. Brother, man, when you're coming to Durban, bro, we need the skill. You send me a DM, I'll come anytime. Even tomorrow, I can come. Me, I'm unemployed, man. I can come anytime. Uh, three to five days, the cost is how long it takes. Is gold a safe haven? I wouldn't say it is, but I mean, it's, you know, I wouldn't say it is. You're about to show us what you recorded on US 30, bro. Oh yeah, I was no, I was I wasn't gonna play it. I was gonna show you. I'm still gonna show you. Let me let me show you. Let me show you what I did on US thirty. Gonji on 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 Mac. How do you go to your things, Gonji? Uh, okay. This is beautiful. What's the date today? Twenty sixth. Um. 
26th, I'm going to show you in just a bit. I'm going to show you in just a bit. Manando the coat, Abutuak, Abutuak, Abutuak. <laughs> I am Mr. Kendall's dick. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. I misbehave. Free state, there's three people in free state. Send a DM, I'll come. I'll come, I'll, I'll come, I'll come. Botswana 2021 uh, is in our plans. Botswana, Namibia. Uh, and a couple more. So this is this is my US thirty for today. So Dr. Martin US thirty twenty sixth. Uh, I'm gonna I'm just gonna open it to show you that I'm not scared of US thirty. And this thing I traded on a daily. Uh, no, no. Let's open this. No man, US thirty bullet ha job utaka ruban. Okay, fine. So that's US 30 for you. Uh, it's opening up. So you will see that this is US 30. I mean, you won't even have to ask. If you trade US 30, then you'll know. This Ashi US date, Ashi US date for our time frame. Ashi US date. Here or not. US state, Tashi US state, Kiona, Kiona US state, who are one. And this is a whole 16 minute video, so you can see US 30. Let's see how this is born. US state, I was explaining for my students. There you go, US 30. So, <laughs> um, now your state is your state is a small kid, Joe. Carly feels a guy on your state is a man. You were stately, a carly man. Carly feels a guy. Let me see. Are you coming to Namibia? Yeah, I'm going to come to Namibia. Uh, Doc, are you short sighted? I see you squinting when looking at the screen. Yeah, I mean, I wear classes full time, actually. I wear classes full time, so these are my classes. So when I'm like this, I'm like normal. So, yeah, I wear glasses. Mm. Hey, fine. I can read, but understanding, I'm, I'm going to have to take a second. What do you get next one as your fundamentals? I don't know. I don't trade fundamentals. I trade technicals. Um, are you coming to Namibia? Yeah, man. Are you taking requests? No, man, I'm not taking requests. I'm just... Um, I'm just... Lipalale, 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 King Lipalale. You made US 30 fashionable. You also made Nasdaq fashionable before many traders could trade ruling your why it's I'm actually I'm very proud to say I never saw it from anyone in SA man. When I started trading US 30, bro, you can ask Pelelani Mugadi when I started trading US 30. That was a long time ago, man, and we, we made it. We made it fashionable. All the brothers are now on, and it's good. You know, we paved the way. Uh, which moving averages? I just answered that earlier. 
US debt is quite simple when you trade when you take into consideration the psychological the key levels as well as moving averages. Um, I learned how to trade US debt from Stylish's lives. You guys are really amazing. Are you coming to Swaziland? I'm gonna come as well to Swaziland. It's about the transparency. You, that's fine, bro. What's the equal distance on your major support on US thirty? Uh, please save the live. Um, what moving average is okay? If you take a loss for the day, do you leave trading for the next day or continue? Whatever. It really depends on how the loss happened. If the loss happened because of poor decisions, that I can really try to fix myself at that instant and moment go back into the market striking and make the money back. Like last night, I think I blew uh, about 22 point, what? 22 point, no, I think it was 20, 20 what? So 11.9 plus 11.7, um, that should be 23 something. I blew that amount because of stupid decisions, but I just decided to take a break. So it is what it is, man. After I blew 30,000 last week, so for the previous two weeks, I've actually blown 53,000 plus. But I mean, we still, we keep moving. But my subscribers are still eating because sometimes when I come in, I, I, tr I, I scale in and my scaling in really killed me on yesterday's moves. Even when the trade was a winning trade, but I still kind of blew my account because I over leveraged on that account. But you mean, I mean, we still sent winning trades. So, I mean, it is it is what it is. It's whatever. Mm, do you work with major key FX, bro? Who's, who's major key FX? Who's that? By the cost to get the dis distance between psychological levels. Yeah, man, 100%. <laughs> Please demonstrate using ink drawings. We will understand. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. The accent, though, did you go to an African high school? No, man, I didn't. I, I my accent changes with with my mood. So if I want, I I, I blat. If I want, I kuluma. If I want, I talk like, you know, like I can I can even talk like this, bro. Like I can talk like I'm from Vitzburg because that's that's actually where I went to, bro. So like, my my accent really changes with the mood. So yo, man, it is what it is, bro. It is what it is, bro. But it is what it is, bro. Like, I can talk what, however I want to. <laughs> I'm kidding. You didn't answer the moving averages part, doctor. Yeah, man. I know. From Mozambique. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. Uh, between you and Stylish, who taught the other? Stylish is actually my mentee. I taught him how to trade. Mm, 1,000k within a week. Yeah, man. You can. You can. We love you from Namibia. Thank you so much, man. Is the market closed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When are you going to pull up at the hood? Which hood are you talking about? I was in the hood today, bro. Gold is actually good to trade. The what they a real definition of a mentor would I just wish other mentors had time for their mentees? Because sometimes I feel like it's about the money. I love your work, Abudi. Mudi, you know, my brother, you came to the course and you are getting full, full, full attention and you're eating from your hard work. Boske, Boske. Mm, why is Nasdaq not volatile today? I haven't checked for the past four hours, bro. That thing really broke the consolidation. What are your advice to those who trade PTMM, flash card, ICT strategies? I would say keep life simple and you'll be happy, man. Keep life simple, you'll be happy. Give us the, Niger the Nigerian accent. Waiting hop on, bros. Um, me a day fine, bros. No ahala. I'm telling you, bros. What's your take on the systems that are selling? No take, bros. Vetis. It is what it is. Are your sunglasses prescription? These are not sunglasses. These are actually prescription glasses. Uh, they've got that um, anti-glare thing, yeah. Anti-glare, like, yeah. I paid about 7000 for these, so... What's this frame again? This is a Hugo Boss frame, anti glare with a thick lens that was flattened. So I had to pay for all these extras, summed up to like seven grand. So yeah, it is what it is. Mm. What's your take on US 30? It's on the private telegram. Any PDF on NES 100? No, man. I, be, I don't believe in those PDFs. 
like PDF strategies, man. Like, how do you deal with your emotions when losing? It really depends on what, what I'm going through at the time. Sometimes I just move. Sometimes I hardly move. Like even today, I was so moody in the morning because I was thinking to myself that, what the hell? Like, how can I blow so much money? But I mean, I'm fine now. You can see, like, I'm really happy. Because I know, man, we keep moving. We move. Tomorrow morning, man, I, I, I'll make back that money. You know what I'm saying? Still waiting for the demonstration. I'll do it. Not today, man. I'll do it maybe on the next live I'm going to host. Um, so, yeah, guys, let me just end the live here. Uh, and then I hope you guys really did learn a thing or two. So let me end the live. I will not save it on my timeline. So it's going to be on the other pocket. So if you want to go watch it, you can go watch it on the other pocket of my previous live videos. I do have a couple saved there, like oh, four or five videos. But I'd like to think that this video will be on YouTube. And if you're watching this on YouTube now, you must follow me. Go to Instagram, Dr. Martin, and follow me. Joking, guys. That's a joke. <laughs> So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to end the live now. Hope you guys really have a beautiful evening. And keep winning, stay winning. Don't forget to pray. Don't forget to keep yourselves sane and healthy mentally and psychologically. But other than that, have a beautiful evening, guys. Bless up and shout out, shout out, shout out, shout out. Mm. Yeah, no, I'm ending the life. I'm ending the life. I'm ending the life. I'm ending the life. So shout out, send your last goodbyes, and I will be out of this live. Yeah, man. Thank you so much, guys. Yo, questions. I didn't even see this. Oh my goodness. But anyways, bye guys, bye, beautiful evening to all of you.